Hey guys, I'm at here. So do you have miners in your home and you wish you could monitor their device? So with this today's video, it is possible. In this video, we're gonna be checking out KidsGuard Pro by which you can monitor any Android device without root. So this video is sponsored by ClipGuard. So before we start, make sure to hit the subscribe button and the thumbs up button. So let's get right into it and let's see how it works. So first of all, go to the ClipGuard website. I've given the link in the description box. After that, log in here. So once you're here, sign in with your login details. If you haven't signed up yet, then you'll have to create account first. After that, let me enter my details. After that, press sign in. You can also sign in with Google. So here's the product we're reviewing today, Kids Guard Pro for Android. So let's check out the setup guide. First of all, you will have to go here. You will need to have the Android device you want to monitor and do not use the product for illegal purposes. So first of all, what you'll have to do is go to this link on your mobile phone. So let's go ahead and download the application. So here's my Android device. First of all, open the browser and wait for it to load. After that, in the URL bar, enter the ClipGuard website address, which is www.clipguard.net. After that, I'm going to press enter. So here's the website you can slide right to download if you're unable to do it then what you can do is you can click the link given below to download it i'm gonna click here and after that click on download and wait for the file to be downloaded it is of 10.9 megabytes so here is the apk file after that i'm gonna click on it to open it so make sure to allow unknown sources if you haven't yet and install the system update service so it will be done in a moment so now it is done installing after that click on open and the application will open so agree with the terms and now i'm gonna enter my email and password then i'm gonna click on sign in now it's signing in here you'll have to enter your child's name for example i'm gonna enter my own name which is abdullah after that you'll have to enter the child's age so i'm gonna select a random age because i'm 23 and i'm not a child so you'll have to activate all of the permissions i mentioned here click on got it and after that it will take you step by step to enable all of the permissions so enable the permissions so that the application appears on the top of other apps so after that click on proceed to settings and then you will have to turn off play protect go to settings in the play protect and turn them off then click on already set and click on yes after that go to accessibility and turn on system update service after that you will need to allow usage tracking for that click on proceed to settings again and here you will have to find system update service in my case it is located at the bottom so after that allow it then you will have to activate the notification access for that enable system update service here again then you need to give it the permission to do the tasks and after that you'll click on start now allow all of the permissions given here and after that wait for it to set up everything then ignore the battery optimization option for this application and now when you will click on start monitoring the application will disappear and it will enter the stealth mode so now let me take you to the menu and here you will see that currently it is appearing here but the icon will disappear in a few seconds and here you can see that the icon has disappeared so now let's continue the process on the website so as i showed you on my samsung device that after clicking start monitoring button the application disappears so scroll down and then you will have to click on the verify setup button so i'm gonna click here so now my samsung galaxy s6 is totally under my control so you can see that it is showing the account id samsung galaxy s6 edge you can see the battery level gps is off wi-fi is on and the device status is online because currently the wi-fi is on and the mobile can be monitored so let's check out other files i'm gonna check out the call logs so here are the numbers shown so i last used this device in april so it is showing the call duration the date and also the numbers here so after that i have the messages 
all of the messages are shown here i'm not going to show you the content obviously to that we have the contacts so there are no contacts because i don't use this device anymore then we have the browse history after that you can also access the photo files here are the folders the download and the cim folder and the pictures are also shown here so you can view them here here are some pictures clicked while i was making a video this is my old setup and here is a picture of my red dragon keyboard so there we have video preview so it takes a few seconds to download the video after that let's check with the app activities so here is an application which shows the frequency of 156 visits no name is shown there is no whatsapp or any other application in it otherwise it can also be tracked after that we have keylogger so to use this feature you'll have to click the start button and wait for the synced keyloggers then you can view the screenshots kids guard pro can help you monitor the keystrokes detected from the monitored android device each keystroke comes with an app icon indicating where they come from then here we have calendar location tracking after that we have geofence generate a geofence so that you will be notified if your child leaves a designated area so you will have to click the start button to initiate it then we have wi-fi logger and here it shows that it is connected with this wi-fi network then we have social apps here is whatsapp so you'll have to try the kids guards for whatsapp and get 10 plus powerful whatsapp monitoring features so all of the applications mentioned here other than line can be tracked without purchasing anything else they come under the license of kid guards pro so after that we have video apps so you can use youtube and tiktok here you can see how much videos are viewed and the screen time and also you can check the search history after that we have live recording option you can record surround so what it will do is it will record the sound around the device so you can select the timer for it also and remember that this feature is not recommended in falling situations when the microphone is occupied or the permission is disabled when the target phone is switched off and when the target phone is not connected to a network you can also record calls so here it is the maximum time for it is 20 minutes and after that you can also record the screen so you can also set the time again so for example let's try out 15 seconds and i'm gonna start recording so now it has started and i'm gonna start using my samsung galaxy s6 edge and let's see if it shows it correctly or not and now the recording is being uploaded this may take a while so please wait or check later it is mentioned here so let's wait for it so the video has appeared here and it is showing my samsung galaxy s6 edge so you can also download the file so the video has been downloaded so let's play it so here you can see that it has recorded the screen and has uploaded it on cloud and you can also download it and play it as shown here so after that we also have the option for remote control you can capture screenshots so let's try it so here a screenshot has appeared after that we also have the option to take photos then we have track keywords option so you will be notified when a specific keyword or face appears on the target device you can have a maximum of 15 alerts and after that we have data export you can also export the data here are call logs messages wi-fi logger browser history and a lot of things as mentioned here you can also select the format for call logs it is available in csv and here are the items so here is a permission check here you can see that all of the permissions are turned on if anything is turned off and you can turn it on directly on the mobile then so these are all of the features in this kit guards pro so guys this was all from today's video and this is how easy it is to monitor any android phone without root if you want to purchase it then i've given all of the related links in the description box and in the pinned comment make sure to hit the subscribe button and the thumbs up button and i'll catch you in the next one until next time this is imat peace out